Hello everyone. Today, I would like to show you that how to create chain rivet family. In this video, I will create two part of family, chain ring piece and main body, and then load and combine into main family. And I will refer those dimensions in the picture to create the parameter. Before go to Revit, I would like to request to subscribe the channel and click the notification bell for the next video. You can download this family in links below. Ok, let go to Revit. To create chain ring pace family. Open the new family. Select the metric generic model adaptive and open it. Select the point element and place on the reference level. Select the point and make adaptive. Select the spline through points and check for is reference line. Select the point element and place on the reference line. Select the point. Select the segment length for measurement type. Assign the segment length parameter to W. Select instance and click OK. Select the point. Select the segment length for measurement type. Select the end for measurement from parameter. Select the points. Assign the rotation angle parameter to rotating angle. Select instance and click OK. Select the point. Select the point and set a reference plane. Place the point to point and click OK. Select the new point. Assign the offset parameter to W. Select the point and set a reference plane. Place the point to point and click OK. Assign the offset parameter to negative W. Select instance and click OK. Select the point and set a reference plane. Place the point to point and click OK. Assign the offset parameter to negative W. Select the point and set a reference plane. Place the point to point and click OK. Assign the offset parameter to W. Go to family type. Add formula for negative W parameter. And click apply. Check and play for rotation angle parameter. Select the reference line and set the reference plane. Draw center and radius arc. Insert radius dimension. Select the dimension and assign to W parameter. Select the reference line and set the reference plane. Draw center and radius arc. Insert radius dimension. Select the dimension and assign to W parameter. Select the points. Select the spline through points and check for is reference line. Go to family type. Check and play for W parameter and rotation angle parameter. Select the reference line and set the reference plane. Draw a circle. Insert radius dimension. 
select the dimension and assign to our parameter. Select instance and click OK. Go to family type. Add a new parameter for D. Select instance and click OK. Set 10 mm for D parameter value as default. Add formula for our parameter. And click apply. Add formula for W parameter. Click apply and OK. Select the reference lines. And make a solid form. Select the point and set 0 mm for segment length parameter. And click apply. Go to family type. Check and play for D parameter. Click apply and OK. Select the geometry. Assign the material parameter to material. Select instance and click OK. Save this family. To create chain segment family. Open the new family. Select the metric generic model adaptive and open it. Select the point element and place three points on the reference level. Select the points and make adaptive. Select the spline through points and check for is reference line. Select the reference line and divide path. Select the fixed distance. Set 50 mm distance parameter as default. Assign the distance parameter to L. Select instance and click OK. Insert and load the created family into main family. Select the family. Assign the material parameter to material. Select instance and click OK. Assign D parameter to D. Select instance and click OK. Select the family. Set negative 90 degrees for rotation angle parameter. Go to family type. Add formula for L parameter. Click apply and OK. Select the family. Repeat the families. Go to family type. Check and play the D parameter. Click apply and OK. OK, chain family creation is completed. If you like this video, Please don't forget to click the like button. Thank you for watching.